I'm just raising awareness for this charity because I think they're the I mean they're, they're brilliant they're brilliant at what they do it's a very beautiful charity absolutely and uh, you know they caught the attention of Mr Beast the number one YouTuber in the world really yes yeah <laughs> I didn't know that. <laughs> yes. They they made a video, I want to say about four months ago, where Mr. Beast flew out to Africa. He donated 100 wells, and Wells of Life was there to, to help build those wells. So, you know, Wells of Life is very credible, everybody. So I encourage <laughs> any, anyone to click the link below, help bring fresh water to these beautiful kids in Uganda, and, and let's, let's, let's become saints. I think that's the message today. That's it. That's it. Be, 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 if I could give one message to Catholics, be truly Catholic in this time. Know your faith. Be catechized. Know how to pray. The key for us Catholics now is, is a simple thing. It's called union with God, theosis, you know, a personal relationship with God. It's, you know, what St. Teresa of Avila, St. John of the Cross, uh, the, 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 the saints spoke about. God is wishing to transform us. But oftentimes we don't want to be transformed by God. And God needs us now. God needs us as saints now. He just, we're, oftentimes we, you know, there is politics and there is gossip and there is news in the church and, and the, the Latin Mass and the Novo Sordo and, and, and different things. But at the end of all of this confusion, we need to arrive. We need to be a church that is transformed by God. So if I could ask people to take up the challenge to be transformed by Christ, to be a new creation in Christ, watch what God will do with you if you're, if you're transformed by God. You know, he can do a lot of things. We do the possible. He does the impossible.